So hey there people and I'm Sleisha Gupta back here on my channel. I'm here after a long break so I'm really sorry for that and but uh, I want to thank you all because even when I was not uplo regularly uploading the videos I saw a very amazing engagement in my previously uploaded videos so thanks a lot for that and from now I'll be uploading uh, very uh, regularly and that's all. So in today's video, I'll be talking about uh, how can you add MetaMask to your Brave browser specifically because uh, Meta, uh, MetaMask is a kind of wallet and uh, this is a Brave browser. It's a very amazing browser actually and uh, if you want me uh, to tell you more about this, I'll be telling you in uh, some other video, not today. So without any further ado, let's get started. So first, uh, let's uh, you have open your browser. And then you'll uh, search MetaMask. So you can uh, take up the first link and then uh, you will get an option to download it for Brave. So if you are uh, trading in crypto or NFTs or any kind of a virtual currency, then uh, this wallet I think is a must. So you must have it. So uh, I would suggest it. And so like here, from here, uh, we clicked on download for Brave and uh, you, you will see a window like this. I have already uh, added this extension in my browser. So I see here an option of uh, remove from Brave. But if uh, you are, uh, if you have not previously added it to your browser, you will uh, see option to add it. For example, if uh, I have removed it and then I click again on add to Brave, then you will see an option like this and then you can click on add extension then it so as soon as it gets downloaded uh, you will see uh, a pop-up screen will appear uh, so from here you can click on get started then uh, obviously you need to agree to all these terms if you want to use it so you can agree to it now here it will ask you that are you uh, new to metamask or do you already have a wallet so I was already having a wallet but if you are uh, completely new to it you can click on create a wallet then you need to uh, type a password you need to agree to the terms and conditions and then you can click on create and uh, when you'll click on uh, create you will uh, see a screen like this you can now simply click on next uh, here it will ask you uh, to add a recovery phase and uh, i suggest you to uh, take up this because it's uh, a good practice for your security reasons so from here uh, you can open your notepad and You can copy all these and save it in your notepad. Then uh, you can click on next. Then you can click on confirm and then you will see a screen like this that your account is created. You can click on all done and then your wallet opens like this. And uh, from here you can uh, surf it out according to you you can uh, check on your account details you can uh, copy your account code from here and you can uh, use it as per your need so i hope that this video was helpful and you might have learned something about this and if you have some doubts or any queries related to the video you can just comment down below and i will be helping you out there and that's all for today and thanks a lot for watching